Not just the holiday season, but also flu season. Oh, yes. And in New Haven, the push is on to get people vaccinated before they get sick. And for some school age children, it's actually required by the state. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is live right now. He is outside the city's health department tonight with more on this, Matt. And this is the clinic that they have here right at the health department. They want everyone to get vaccinated. They're particularly pushing the flu shots for those 65 and un over uh, pregnant women and young kids. And they're also reminding parents that if they have those youngsters in early child care programs, preschool classes, the flu shot is actually mandatory. It's to protect her and protect others. For Masiel Philpo and her three-year-old daughter, Sai, the yearly flu shot is a family affair. It's a routine. It's something that we've been doing. I already have a six-year-old, so it's kind of routine, you know, something that's expected. And New Haven's mayor and health director are hoping folks follow their lead, encouraging them to roll up their sleeves and get that flu vaccine. It keeps people safe. It keeps people out of the hospital. And it's flu season. Winter is coming. In fact, just in September, New Haven says here in the Elm City, there have already been 86 flu-related visits to the emergency room. And while anyone six months and up is eligible for a flu shot, it's actually required for the state's youngest students. They must have their flu shot by December 31st to return after the holiday break. Kids six months to four years old and who are enrolled in early child care programs and preschools must be vaccinated by the end of the month. And Dr. Paul White, an assistant superintendent here in New Haven, says it's pretty simple. It's harder for us, uh, children that age to maintain the healthy habits to that to protect um, washing hands right afterwards. We know how children can be. Sometimes their hand is their tissue and things of that. So we do want to decrease that as much as possible. According to the Connecticut Department of Health, once a child turns five, flu shots are no longer a state of Connecticut requirement for students. But for Maciel and her family, it won't matter. And I can imagine for some parents or families, they're hesitant and, you know, I respect that. But in regards to my family and my kids, I'm all for it. Now, because those children in those early child care programs and in preschool classes need to be vaccinated before they return to school in January, health department's actually going to hold a number of clinics the last week in December to help those families out. We've got the information and the locations on the Channel 3 app. We're live at the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.